In this video, we're going to show you how to do some searching and sorting of contacts. You have your normal search messenger bar, but the extension adds search labels, and we can select by filter. And what it's doing is just looking for the name of the labels that you've got. And so let's say I'm looking for people with GMCRM tag. You'll see right away it's not case sensitive. Now, it doesn't start the search until you hit return or enter, and it'll bring up anybody whose label starts with GMCRM. Now, if I just want to look at partners, I could put a space P and hit return, and now I'm just looking at partners. Or I can get rid of that, and they'll go back to the normal sorting by messenger, which is by time, most recent at the top. Now, there are some other things I can do. I can check this here and just look for unlabeled people. That is people that has not been labeled. Now, you'll see one here is showing a label. Now, I, I did that intentionally. Um, if you have labeled someone and then you're still doing your search, you'll need to refresh your screen for, for the new search filters here to pick up. So I'm just going to ref refresh this screen, and you'll see now when I do unlabeled, Pat doesn't show up. Okay, I labeled him intentionally right before this video just to show you that. So if you see that, you just have to refresh the screen. But this will show you unlabeled, and that's a good way to sort through and say, Oh, did we, you know, did I miss anybody? Is there somebody that I should have or could have tagged that I didn't? And you can you can use that. You can also check what was sent by you last. And that's a good way to go in your list and see if there are people that you're still waiting for responses from. And you can even sort this by label. So let's say I want to show people in the GMC or in partners group that the last message was sent by me. So I'll just hit enter there, and these you'll see you, you, you. So I sent the last message, and that just lets me know, like here's one here, are you still having? That's somebody who hasn't gotten back to me yet. So I can go there very quickly. I can see, oh, I'm still waiting on a response. Let me do a follow-up with that person. Or you can say last message sent was not by you. Okay, these are people, perhaps, that are waiting for something from me. Okay, and... Um, if that's the case, then I can go down there and say, oh, i got to get back to this person. Oh, i got to get back to this person. And that's a, just a good way to sort people. And you can hit select filter, and it'll just go back and show you all those. Or we can delete them, and it'll go back to the regular search. So that is, for now, how to search and sort your labels. We are going to be adding tags very shortly so that you can add multiple types of filter things um, to people. And you'll be able to, you know... For instance, partners who are waiting on this or who are involved in this project. Maybe I have different partners for different softwares. I can put them in a partner category and then I can tag them with a different, you know, one tag for each software they're a partner of, for example. And then you can do more refined search. So that's coming soon. But for now, that's how search works and that's how the filters work. As always, if you have any questions or something doesn't seem to be working right, please reach out to us. We'll be happy to help. And if you have a feature suggestion, please reach out and let us know. Thanks.